I wanted to be a part of this project because the Smurfs are so iconic and they promote friendship and good energy. I play Smurfette and her personality is really brave, she's adventurous, and when she wants something, she goes and gets it. The adventure from the Smurf Village to the Forbidden Forest is crazy. There's tons of creatures like glow-in-the-dark bunnies and fire-breathing dragonflies. It's really cool and really exciting. What makes Smurfette a strong female lead is that she's the only one for a while, you know, and she wants to figure that out. She doesn't take no from anybody, especially Papa Smurf, and she goes and she gets what she wants, like I said. Teamwork is so important on this journey because everyone has their own special quality that can help one another out. In this new fully animated film, Smurfs are one big family of tiny blue creatures. And just like every family, they have to look out for each other. Especially when Smurfette and her friends decide to venture out into the dangerous, mystical, forbidden forest to find out what they believe to be more Smurfs. When they set off on their quest, they encounter all kinds of magical creatures like glow-in-the-dark bunnies, fire-breathing dragonflies, and so many mysterious plants. Some that follow you with their eyes and others that try to eat you whole. A Smurf's gotta keep some secrets, but I'll share one. Smurfette's secret is that she doesn't always feel like she fits in since Gargamel originally created her, and he doesn't think she's a real Smurf. Everyone feels like an outsider sometimes, you know? Everyone from kids to parents, they've had this experience, so they can really relate to Smurfette as a strong character. Smurfette is kind of my hero because she's so brave and she does everything she can to be the best Smurf she can be. She inspires me like her. I always want to be brave and to challenge myself. 